I really like that. Nice. Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. Yes, it's been a while. My hair has grown out now. And I'm trying to have like a mullet type of thing going on. I hope you guys are well. Welcome to those who are new to the channel. Uh, consider subscribing if you enjoy this video. Today I'm going to be doing another reaction video for you guys and I'm pretty excited because it's a new song by Carl Vincent. The name of the song is Red Rock Ridge and I'm actually a friend of Carl's on Facebook and he talked about how he wanted to go heavier with his music and I am a huge fan of dark wave and like metal and rock and stuff being infused in synth wave and you know all of that. So I'm pretty excited. I hope you guys are excited as well. Without further ado, let's get into the video. So I think this is the album art, like which he used for Spotify and Apple Music and stuff, probably. That's him with his guitar. This should be a guitar heavy track. Yep. That sounds pretty catchy. That's a catchy riff. Okay, using some visuals here. Nice transition. Very nice transition with the drums, toms, and all of that. But I feel like I recognize these visuals. Um, is it from a movie, TV series? I'm not sure. Please comment if you know where it's from. I should definitely check the description, maybe you mentioned it there. That riff is like just so infectious, you know? There's that transition again. Just oh, it brings back the riff, just showcasing the riff. This is, this song is like so reminiscent of the 80s glam metal bands uh, they would usually have like that pause in between like not like, exactly a pause like a, a portion of the song where they just have like maybe the guitar riff and like just some percussions the drums um, it's really good for like live performances and stuff just getting the crowd involved this would work really well I think in a live setting and the drums are pretty good like I don't know if you programmed the drums or you actually played them live, but they sound pretty good. And there's that riff again. Oh, I thought he was going for that transition there, but... I think that... I think he's using the whammy bar, or you just go like... I've, I've seen those on guitars, um, a lot of guitarists use them to have that similar kind of effect. Um, oops, that similar kind of effect um, with the whammy bar. It sounds pretty, I think he used that effect on here. With those, with that lead, not exactly this riff, but the other. Oh, I really like this transition. Oh, it just sounds so good. This is, the, this is the time, like these are the times where I wish I had long hair, you know, just headbang. It, it feels so good when you headbang with long hair. <laughs> but I'm growing out a mullet, so I'll be able to like headbang my heart out pretty soon, I guess. So the cops are chasing the dude. Um, the visuals go really well with the whole and I don't know if you can hear the sound effects like the whoosh sounds and the atmospheric stuff which you put in it's it's pretty cool I mean I can't hear many synthesizer elements but those elements they work really well and it's a more guitar heavy um, track which is pretty cool which is nice I really like that Very, very cool. Um, not too heavy. It's not too heavy, but 
it just it's per like just enough you know to get you going to get you like headbanging This riff is so catchy. It's really, it's a really catchy riff. Dun, 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 dun. Not like this one. Even the other one was just. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, I forgot the other riff now. <laughs> I think that the yeah, the whammy bar thing with the effects on that. This is the lead guitar. Thing which I'm talking about, uh, which I was talking about earlier. I mean, this song is just like perfect for when you're at the gym working out. Um, I feel like it really motivates you to work out harder. Um, I don't go to the gym personally, so I wouldn't know. Um, but I think if I ever do join a gym, if I ever do start working out. This would definitely be on my playlist. Definitely. It just makes you feel so pumped up. Uh, kind of reminds, like, I can see, like, um, an 80s montage, like, action montage. And this song in the background just works so well. Like, 80s action montage, which with the karate and all of that, you know, just... Okay, is, is the song ending? Is that a... Is that a fade out? I believe it is cliche, but it's cool, it's cool. I mean, a lot of songs in the 80s did it, so. Nice. That was a, that was a nice song. Bumped me up a bit. Um, I feel that energy in my body right now. Um, made me want to headbang. And it's been a while since I've heard song a synthwave song which is like this it's been a while the last time was i listened to i think this is shred wave i think that was the last song which i remember which sounded similar so the song was pretty pretty cool pretty guitar intense guitar heavy um i thought that the drums worked really well um, I didn't really hear a lot of synthesizers, uh, but I heard a lot of sound effects being used, like just to add that atmosphere in the song, so it worked really well. The shredding, shredding was top notch, A plus from me. Um, I really liked the transitions uh, which he used, um, the shred and the guitar, and, um, I mean the toms in the like with the drums and that build up, really worked really well, really pumped me up. Um, it's, it's like like I said earlier I think it's a really good track uh, to play live um, it work, work really well it really has that I think uh, anthemic type of sound you know so it would work well uh, maybe you can have like a live version where you have vocals that would work really well I think uh, and um, it was a bit repetitive I wouldn't lie about that it, uh, kind of repetitive but I think that's how it's meant to be meant to have been the track as a whole uh, but i do i did enjoy it um, so those are my thoughts if you're new here please consider subscribing let me know your thoughts by commenting down below uh, let me know what movie uh, slash tv show that the visuals were from because i do remember seeing i mean i do recall the car the black one uh, i do remember it vaguely but I'm not too sure the, what the name of the movie or the name of the TV show is. So let me know in the comments. And thank you for watching. I will catch you with another video probably next week. Until then, bye bye.